Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Um, I'm just going to be another short one. And today, this is another, this is a King's Indian opening. And this is a what not to do. This is something that, this is the reason why you've, you keep playing the same lines over and over again. Because you want to work out what things do work and what things don't work. And I found out something didn't work. And this is actually a good move. The, the computer actually is happy with that move as well. So potentially what I wanted to do was move my knight down here so I could defend this square. But the problem is you only want to do that if the queen is here and then the bishop wants to go in this square and then off for a trade. And then we can defend our dark square bishop. So this is something I came up with, which is probably not a bad idea, but it's very passive. And it's sort of like being scared for monsters under the bed. And yeah, you don't want to be scared of stuff that's not actually happening because he actually hasn't done all this. So something I learned even when I was playing poker is when you do things over and over again, you sort of condition yourselves and you've got to be careful. Sometimes we can condition ourselves badly. And this is so passive and so hiding that it's just, it's terrible, especially when the queen's not down here. Like if the queen's going to be down there and going to be targeting the dark square bishop, that's, that's fine. But in this case, it's not. So then we've gone too passive, and this is not really a good thing to do. And yeah, exactly, this is what I had in mind. So yeah, it's the position is not too bad at this stage. It's very passive. Um, this was a blunder because now I've opened up this spot as well. So I was thinking about pushing this square. But usually in the King's Indian, what I've been saying is the rook stays on this end, and you try and push up this pawn. Okay, so now he's really targeting this square. Um, and then I do a big blunder. And I just, just pause the video and have a look and see what I did wrong, if you can work it out. Alright, it's very short. And that's the move. And that's it. Game over. Checkmate. And that's your smothered mate, Mickey D. Alright. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.